okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. I just got done hoeing my lovely garden. Here are my 12 habaneros. Some of them are super midgets. I don't know why they don't want to grow, but they're having issues. These ones are doing better, but yeah. And then I've got my cranberry beans and my trellis. They're kind of grown. I've got 24 beautiful oh, noisy motorcycles. Beautiful tomato plants. And keep moving. These, what are these? Oh, these are my red cayennes. Oh, there's my hoe. That was, that's what I was using. My cayennes. There's some, they're still green, but they're growing. Can you see them? Aren't they pretty? They're so lovely. And then over there, I've got, I've got 12 sweet banana peppers and then 12, well, supposedly jalapenos, but one of them looks like a banana pepper, so I'm not sure what's happening. This, that's in the jalapeno aisle, and that's definitely not a jalapeno, so we'll see. This is supposed to be a jalapeno. That's supposed to be jalapeno, and that one looks like a jalapeno, so we'll see. Ooh. And my dill that keeps coming up that I just have to go around and let grow, because I do pickle my cucumbers, which aren't in this garden, they're in the raised beds, but I'll get to them. More dill. More cranberry beans. I love cranberry beans. They're so good. And then I've got my butternut squashes. Got a few of them. Some potatoes that I threw in there because the squashes didn't come up and I was impatient. So now there's potatoes and squashes put together. And these are my bell peppers. These are orange, supposedly. And that rose green. There's... 12 of each, so I've got 24 bell peppers and then uh, and then 48, yeah, 24 bell peppers and 48 different hot peppers, so 72 peppers total, total, 24 tomatoes total, and some milkweed, I left the milkweed so the butterflies could Come hang out. I didn't leave all the milkweed. The milkweed was going crazy, but I left till now. But yeah, and there's a little spider friend in here somewhere. Let me see if I can find him. Oh, I found his web. I don't know if you can see it. It's hard to see. I don't know where he went. Oh, I hope I didn't step on him, buddy. Okay, and then I've got my raised beds. So I've got my my normal Swiss chard, my red Swiss chard, then my lettuces. When I planted them and then it rained, it kind of washed some of the seeds away, so it, I planted new stuff, if you can see them. It, it's like forced succession planting. That one seemed to do okay. This one, not so much. My carrots, they all washed to this end, so I planted, oh, they're coming up over there. I planted some new ones the other day on that end, so they should be coming up. And then I got cucumbers that didn't come up at first, but they're finally growing now. That one, it's moved from its original spot because, well, like I said, the rain washes it. The soil, it just lets them, lets the seeds go crazy. And then I got some, I've got summer squash growing in there. This one's not flowering yet, but it will be. And that one, I got some zucchinis going. And then the zucchini over there. And then this, my lovely corn. The middle row was planted a week later, but all of this purslane in here, this is edible. I eat it in my salads. And you can pickle it, it's great pickled and put in potato salad. But yeah, there's my garden update. It's looking good. I'm, ex I'm super stoked about the corn. And now I'm gonna pick up my junk and go inside. <laughs> 